We're joined now by Senator John Barrasso, Republican from Wyoming. Okay. Senator, always a pleasure to have you on the show. I know Thank you're you, very much involved in the middle of this. Would you handicap it for us? Senator Schumer says 50-50 chance of success. People on our program today say it's more like 60-40 chance of success or 70-30. What says Senator John Barrasso? Well, I think it's critical that we do find success. It is the only way we have to reverse the damaging impacts of Obamacare that it's having on people's care as well as their coverage. We've seen prices skyrocket. The choices are going way down. We need to get this passed in an effort to eliminate the mandates, eliminate all of the taxes associated with Obamacare to get decisions out of Washington and back into the hands of patients and at folks back home and to put Medicaid on a sustainable path for the future. Well, the Wall Street Journal editorializes this morning and says you've got to do it. This is your last best chance of reform. Take it and run with it. Otherwise, you're not the party of government. They're urging you on. Get it done. I agree with them. It's crucial that we do. Obamacare is a bus going over a cliff. The Democrats are saying, stay on the bus. I'm trying to rescue the people who are on the bus to get them away from Obamacare, where they have just seen the skyrocketing premiums, choices have gone down. For next year, Stuart, there are going to be over half of the counties in the United States where people have either one choice or no choices to buy Obamacare insurance. So look, if somebody has a pre-existing condition and no one where they live is selling insurance, they're not covered. Our Republican bill makes sure that everyone with a pre-existing condition can continue to stay on their insurance under the under the Republican plan. We make sure the 20 up to 26 can stay on and we basically and look, I'm, I'm a state senator at heart, working as a doctor in the state senate in Wyoming. We knew if we had the same amount of money, we could help many more people with medical problems on Medicaid than when Washington gets involved with its one-size-fits-all approach. You can do that in the Senate bill that we're proposing. Can't do it under Obamacare. Do we get a yes vote at the end of this week? That's where I'm working right now to do that with my colleagues. I'm a yes vote. We're trying to bring everyone on board. Okay, got it. Senator, always a pleasure. And thanks, mm -hmm. sir. I know you're busy. Thanks, I know you're sir. working 24 I got it. But thanks for being with us, So We do Thank appreciate you. it. Thank you.